How's it going? Uh, you need to go away. Two hundred and thirty-five. One thirty. Buyer one thirty. Buyer one thirty. Buy one thirty. Buy one thirty. Alright, see you guys. You're lucky that none of you are going, especially you. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another one. Uh, it's auction day. It is also New Year's Eve, which means I'm... Well, okay, here's the deal. I have a family Christmas tonight, and I'm supposed to be there very shortly after the auction actually starts. So, unless the auction is super tiny, I'm not gonna have much, if any, of the uh, prices on this one. But I thought you guys might like to see what is actually still in the auction. So I thought worst case scenario, uh, you guys get to see the auction without prices. So that's kind of the plan right now. Uh, the auction actually doesn't start for just a little bit yet. So I am headed there and uh, we'll check that out. So I'll see you guys there in a little bit. Well, I'm here and there's a bunch of people here. I'm about to get a lot of looks. Okay. First off, we have a bunch of bunnies. Now remember guys, I probably won't be able to stay for much of any of the prices. But if there are any prices, everything is by the animal. Mm, kinda cool. You guys there getting their grub on. See, you never know what you're gonna see. We got guinea pigs. Big barred rooster. <laughs> One that's proud of himself. Lots of bantams. Okay, I didn't see the hen down there. I saw an egg and I was like, someone put an egg in with some roosters. That's not right. Someday I'll get some more of these again. Those are cool. Big bunnies. I bet they bring 20 bucks a piece. Drake runners. Playing in the mud. First chicken I ever owned, brown legger. Delawares, Bards, Dwarf Bunnies, Hens, lots of hens. Lop bunnies. Need yeah, big boy. All right, guys. Lion head rabbits are still ridiculous. Who did that? I mean, jeez. We got Muscovies. I would love to have some more Muscovies. I do need another Drake. Still need another Drake. Wish I could stay here. Maybe there'll be a bunch. Oh my goodness, there is a bunch coming up. That's a lot of bunnies. Man, man, my wife is gonna be so mad if I'm late for Christmas though. Ugh. Black star hens, more muscovies. Are you serious? Couple of white hens, more 
black stars. Look at all the Muscovies. You're kind of cool color, bud. Nice blue. Wouldn't it be cool to get a blue drake in there? It's a whole cage of blues. They're all eagles. <laughs> a lot of drakes, though. Drakes typically go pretty well because a lot of people are using them for food. White one, black one, blue one. Good mixed lot of birds. Little bunnies. Hey, ducks. <laughs> White Chinese, I only have one. Too bad I can't stay to, you know, increase that. Not that I need another breed, but. There's one chicken in there. And more Muscovies. Always a sale you can't stay for. Excuse me. How's it going? You need to go away. So I'm not going to say much about that particular part. Uh, there was a guy who brought some birds, did not appreciate me filming them. Don't know why. Yeah. Anyway, I'm cutting all that out. Let's get back to it. That was interesting. Cool little Rexes. I've always wanted some Rexes again. They're cool rabbits. Bunch of layers, some barred hens, some more of the brown leggers there. Bunch more layers. A lot of people are getting rid of their their laying flocks this time of year because they have you know cold weather running up. Get some new ones in the spring. Pretty rooster there. Those are cool birds. I don't know why. They just look like the little jungle fowl type. They look pretty. Big old black roosters. A blue one. Guineas. I got a few of them, not very many. I don't need more guineas right now. What do we got here? Oh, Ericanas. Good looking pullets. Mm -hmm. More pullets. Oh, speckled Sussex. Those are cool birds. I've always liked the way those looked. Some more bunnies. Some young birds, more roosters, mixed a lot of bunnies, cleaning himself. Good job, bud. Look your best. And these are interesting. Anyone know what those are? I'm guessing they're a crossbreed myself, but uh, I'm not sure. If it's maybe a bronze, like Royal Palm Narragansett or something in there. Let me know what you think. What is it? Yes, I know it's a turkey. Eggs from the beautiful hens, you know. More hens. More bunnies. More bunnies. Yeah. 
He got a big old comb on him. Oh yeah. Uh, more cool roosters. Man, big bunnies. Hey buddy. Got some nice little Old English pears. Looks like it. I miss having Old English. Maybe gotta hide the roosters that way. Are they all roosters Uh, I see at least two. No, there's a hen in there. There's at least one. Kind of hard to see. Maybe it's two pairs. Yeah. You know, it wouldn't hurt a thing to have it on us. That's what I would have done. Pretty lady. Dude, you sound pathetic. Like that was a lame crow, dude. Anyway, got a bunny with eyeliner. Or maybe just some of the that bunny rubbed off onto it, I don't know. Young birds. Ooh. I always forget what the name of this breed is. Oh, they're kinda cool. And the hens. Cool. There are a ton of cages. Now that's cool. I can keep old English pears in there. I can keep, oh, this is a good pigeon breeder box. What do you guys think? And I'm gonna be in so much trouble if I'm not at thank, uh, Christmas. I, I gotta stay around for it though, right? These are awesome. Hmm. Oh, we'll see what happens. Might have to apologize to my wife in advance. Sorry, hon. Hmm. <laughs> Now that's fancy. Looks like an old chinchilla setup. Yeah, peacock. Or peacock house. That is a lot of cages. Normally there's never this many. Why is all the cool stuff here when I can't be? I know I've said that a whole bunch, but it's still true. Mm, wire, T-posts, I can always use more T-posts. Goat milking stanchion. Hmm, that'd be great. I don't even know what this is for. That's fancy though. Huh. Mm, hog panels. Well, uh, not a very big auction. I kind of expected that because Typically the winter auctions are pretty small. So nothing crazy crazy, uh, but there's some cool stuff here. And I could really use some Muscovies. But yeah, this is the first auction though I've ever had anyone get mad at me for filming. That guy was not happy. Anyway, I don't want to cause any drama. I'm happy that I get the chance to film here. It would be pretty easy to get, you know, told that hey, it's just too much of a disturbance. But there's a lot of people that come up and say hi. Oh well, I need to stop complaining about it. Uh if there is prices, awesome. If not, sorry. Uh, and if I buy something, you'll see it here in a bit. Ooh, pumpkin pie, canned goods, stovetop stuffing. What happened here? Pineapple. I do like pineapple. <laughs> Never know what you'll see. That's Vincent Van Gogh. Huh? That is Vincent Van Gogh. Vincent Van Gogh. Now that is an epic name for... I love him. I want him to be mine. What's up, Vincent Van Gogh? How are you? You're pretty chilled. Hey, you are pretty chill. So Hi, bud. Well, I don't need a goat, so that works out. <laughs> Last but definitely not least, we got ourselves a big old mixed lot here with a pumpkin to chew on or a gourd. Hey dude, how are you? you Wanna be cool? Oh, what do we got? A sheep and four goats. Huh? Oh. But I'll do it. Okay, 
I have got to get out of here. One, you can go ahead, lady. That's fine. Uh, one, I'm late. Not late, late. I'm just pushing the boundaries of uh, being in trouble. And yeah, I'm in trouble. Uh, so I did buy some stuff, but we are going to have to wait till either tomorrow or whenever the heck I come over here to pick everything up because I spent way more money than what I was planning on. Basically, I was planning on spending like 20, 30 bucks maybe at the most. Uh, yeah, that, that number disappeared pretty quickly. Uh, I did get those cages. I bought two of them. One assembled, one disassembled. We more than well wanted to pay, but I got it. Ooh, that's gonna hurt, but I think you guys are gonna love it because I am gonna have some great space for. Uh, you know, breeder pairs, stuff like that. I'm, I'm really excited about it. I think you guys are gonna love it. So anyway, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get to Christmas and I will talk to you guys later. Okay, so it's a couple days later. Here, picking up all the stuff. Whew, that thing is heavy. I'm really wishing I would've brought someone to come help me with it. But uh, it's even bigger than what I remembered. I am so ready for this thing to be at the house and used. Well, no. I did buy this one as well. This one is one that you brought along just in case the other two sold for enough. Apparently they did, and I bought it. And I uh, got put it together yet. What do you guys think? Thinking about taking these, I don't know if you guys have any good ideas or not. I think these were used for rabbits before I got a hold of them, because there's a bunch of hair and stuff that's caked on there. I'm afraid that they'll rot out, and so I didn't know if I like scrubbed them real good or something. And then maybe if I can paint them or if there's something else that's better. If you guys know what would be better to go ahead and you know put on those boards to make them so they last longer, go ahead and drop me a comment because it could really use the help. I'm gonna do some research also, but uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna finish loading this stuff up and then I'll pick you guys up later. All right. Hey guys, uh, I'm at home. I'm just gonna go ahead and finish up the video now because I think it's probably getting a little bit on the long side, but you know. It'll be what it'll be. I did get this cage out and I got the other one put away. I haven't got it put together yet, but I am really excited about using these. Uh, we will have some pigeon breeder pairs in at least one of them. Not sure what's gonna be the other ones, but we'll find out soon enough. But, here, hold on. Well, now that he's in here, I can show them to you better. This is our new Muscovy Drake. Bought him at the auction there uh, from the angry man. Was gonna film it, but I thought, why ruffle feathers? It's not worth it. Turkeys went their screen time. Uh, but yeah, he's here. I thought, you guys know I have brown Muscovies, and I thought, what would be better mixed with the chocolates than some blue? Because I'm a sucker for blues. So yeah, there is our new Drake. What do you guys think? I mean, he's not an eagle head, which would be cool. He does have some white wing patch. I'm really curious uh, what the brown-blue mix will do. I'm pretty excited about it. Anyway, it's snowy, the turkeys don't like it. I will say though, uh, apparently today the turkeys got a little bit aggressive with the kids. These are still loud. Uh, but the turkeys got a little bit aggressive with the kids. I did have one tom jump on my middle daughter and two of them jump my youngest. So, we're gonna have to fix that. I am gonna keep two toms of each breed because whenever you keep one, he seems to die and leave you stranded with hens. At least that's my experience anyway. So I'm keeping a couple, one for a breeder, one for a backup, or two breeders, whatever you wanna call it. It is what it is. So I will be getting rid of some toms here in the near future. But yeah, anyway, that's kinda of what went on. Hope you guys liked the video. I know I didn't get all the prices. I got a lot more of them than I thought I would though. So, thumbs up for that. If you guys do like the content, if you guys want to subscribe, that would be awesome. Uh, if not, we'll just see you on the next one.